Welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's vlog. It is freezing out here. Let's start off with that. Today is Friday. I didn't go to work today. Today was actually a long day. It was horrible to say the least. So last night my heater stopped working and as you guys know, well most of you guys that are in Texas, we have that um freeze winter freeze going on that i feel like we have every single february i swear it's not as bad as last year thank god because last year's freeze you guys was something else i'm just gonna try to get my freaking hoodie here because i am so cold i'm actually on the way to target right now i really shouldn't be going absolutely anywhere but here i am we're going to target um i have to pick up a few necessities that i need um yeah i really shouldn't be going anywhere i wasn't able to go today hence why my day was so long and horrible so anyway my heater stopped working last night and i left it on one night it started to get super cold by the time i woke up literally you guys my apartment was at 58 degrees you heard that right 58 degrees it was freezing me and storm were trying to stay warm but yeah it's just it was not working so this morning thank god i did get a message that someone was going to be out to my place to fix it i stay like in a private community so i don't have like a leasing office like i don't there's no office here like on site everything is on call so they have to come out and send someone to fix everything basically which is something like that i don't like i'm not a fan of i think that's one of the cons of living like in a private community that you just don't have like people on site as if you were staying at just like a regular apartment complex i was texting my neighbors and stuff because since we're like a private community we're like super close it's like only a couple of us that live here and we're on a little group chat and it turns out that it just wasn't my heater it was everybody's heater that wasn't working so anyway they sent somebody out here since the morning and you guys they literally left my house like a couple of hours ago it is 8 36 okay i am vlogging super late don't judge me but the guy was here he left literally like around 7 p.m he was here all day and i didn't end up going to work because whenever they send out like a contractor you have to be home things that really don't make sense so so I didn't end up going to work because of that. Now that everything is taken care of, I did laundry, I cleaned, I had to do like a couple of things. We're going to Target and I need some essentials like necessities, things that I actually need and not want. But we all know how that goes. Once we're at Target, we're just gonna end up spending some money. But it is 8.40, I need to be there, obviously before 10 because that's the time they close when i tell you guys this is the best foundation ever and look this is the last one in my shade you guys it is meant to be so it's actually the next day i just got home from work right now i didn't finish vlogging yesterday um you guys know i went to target it was super freaking cold by the way and i got home super late and by the time i got home i literally just went straight to sleep i actually didn't even have a good night's sleep i went straight to sleep but it was just a bad night i kept waking up and then i had to work this morning so yeah i'm freaking tired but before i kind of unpack everything i kind of wanted to give you guys a little target haul because i did get a couple of 
fun things. First, I got this really cute sweater. I'm actually wearing it today. I wore it to work. I love the look of it. First of all, I love the color and I just think it's so freaking cute. I got a size large. I kind of like to tuck in my sweaters to kind of make it, I don't know, just like cute and fashionable. I tuck it in. You can't really see. I have my, my camera prompt in this like weird thing. Like literally my mop is holding half of my camera right now. Okay. So, but anyway, you guys get the idea. I kind of just tuck it in, leave a little bit out. Um, but yeah, it kind of was getting warmer today. It's Texas, so you guys know how that goes. It was freezing just two days ago, and it's freaking hot. And I am burning because I forgot that I left the heater on today, okay? Because I got my heater fixed last night. I got this new bra. I'm going to flash you guys really quick, but I love this bra that I got. Picked it up at Target, only $10. And let me tell you guys, it is the most comfortable thing ever. I love wearing like not necessarily sports bras because it's not really a sports bra because it really does support your boobies. I don't know what to call this, um, but I love it. It's like super comfy and it fits me perfect. I got a large as well. Super comfortable. I love how it looks. love how it feels. I don't know what brand it is. I might have the, t I know the sweater is what to wear brand and oh, I think it's right here because I took it out. It literally does not say. All I know, oh right here. Auden, Auden, whatever it's called. Super comfy. Again, only $10. I think I'm going to go back and buy like a million of them in <laughs> all colors because they just feel so good. Next pair of clothing that I cannot wait to wear right now. I'm gonna get naked and put these bad boys on. I heard of these, I forgot where, but when I saw them at the Target, I was like, I need to grab me a pair because supposedly, I don't know why my lighting just keeps going in and out. I think it's because of the white, whatever. They're just like PJ pants, I'm guessing, just like joggers. And they look like this, they're just gray and they have like a white lining right here super comfy if you guys can feel the material on this it is so comfy you guys and these were well that's the brand jockey and they were how much were these bad boys well i think they were like 20 dollars. they were a little expensive and then what else did i get me just super fast i got me a two-way brush like this I heard that these are really good to kind of sleek your hair back. Like right now, I just have it up in a clip, which is like my favorite to go. You guys see those red roots? Like what the fuck? This is like from when they messed up my hair last time. I still have those like red roots, whatever. One side is like firmer than the other one, but I don't know. We'll see. Then I got me this really cute edge, um brush for my baby hairs i really never actually used an actual baby hair brush i always just use like toothbrushes but i liked it because it has like an actual brush on one end and then it has this little comb super cute which i feel like it's gonna be helpful so got this guy and then i got me some more cotton pads because i do use these whenever i take my makeup off and I was running out, so then I got me some more gel. Never tried this guy, but we'll see how it goes. And then, of course, got me some essentials, some Fabuloso. I got me some makeup wipes. Love these. These are actually, no, I'm lying. Walmart's brand is actually my favorite. Then it's the Target brand. These just kind of like make my eye burn a little bit, so I'm not a true fan of those. Next, I got some wipes because you can never have enough wipes i get two for the bathroom and two for the kitchen and then i got me some dio this is a deal that i use is that a hair um but yeah i got me some deal this is the one that i use i've been using this bad boy for years and it has never let me down so this is just the one that i use i don't know why it's not are you gonna focus there you go um so yeah this is the one that i've used for years and it has never let me down it's just a regular gel you know nowadays everybody's using organic or natural whatever type of deal me 
I really don't care. As long as it does what it has to do, that's all that matters. Last but not least, of course, I picked up the foundation that I was talking about. I'm actually wearing it today. I had the other one that I've been using because I could never find my shade. I was using this one. Um, this is the 5.6 and I was mixing it with some concealer so that it can match me. Thank God I found my actual shade. Look what we have here. So we have a Wong Tong Su and we have some crab rangoons. This is all I wanted. I literally came to a Chinese restaurant just to get some crab rangoons. Thank you so much. Thank you. I also just woke up from a nap, so that's why I look a little cray cray. I want to try a crab rangoon on camera for you guys. I'm not gonna lie, I already tried these. They're amazing. Sweet and sour sauce. Crab rangoon. Let's dip it in there. Mm. It is super hot, you guys. Mm. No, it's hot, but that is so good. Mm -hmm. I haven't even got a stain of them. They're so good. You guys saw I just finished cleaning and I kind of redecorated my bathroom so I wanted to show you guys what I got I ended up putting a little artwork right there I already had this in my last apartment but I really like those cute picture frames so I kind of figured I would put them there for now I kind of wanted a big piece it was just kind of tricky because I did not know if to center it like against the wall or center it on this towel rack or center it on my toilet i got that little cute black basket yesterday at target i just use it for like tampons and some like air freshener and wipes and stuff and then this guy right here is just my laundry hamper i got a new shower curtain you guys i absolutely love this color and then i got me some matching little bath mats as you guys can see here um i need to to change my towels i got matching towels and of course black i'm gonna put a really nice black towel right here um, and have like black accents like i do over here i kind of just wanted a little bit more color in here um but of course neutral you guys know my vibe so i got the shower curtain from target and i absolutely love the color um and again just matching little bath rugs to kind of make it fun and then you know you have your neutrals right here the black so yeah and i'm just happy because i finally have a little bit of wall art in here it feels like a little bit more you know done up and then next step is putting wall art up here i think i'm just gonna use the wall art that i already have i have it outside of my balcony um so i think i'm just gonna use that and i think i'm gonna do it probably later on today i need to hurry up and 
edit this vlog so I don't think I'm gonna show you guys in this vlog I'll show you guys in the next one and I think I'm gonna put that piece that I used to have in my last apartment um, I don't know if you guys remember the one with like the girl it's like a back um, super really nice piece i'm gonna put it right here because i don't know what to put in this area and then right here there's a big old space i know what i want number one i want a coat rack like a little kind of like a coat hanger in a way i want to put it right here like a black one super nice i want to put one that's there so i can put all of my big jackets because of course it's been super cold and i don't know where to put them and i don't want to put them in my closet i just want it to have like easy access i did see one at target yesterday but girl that thing was like 35 dollars, and we don't got time for that so i need to find something that i can put here just as a coat hanger because i don't know what else to put there maybe like an entry table but then I was thinking maybe over here, but then I was like, no, that's too much. I want my Dyson to be um, charging there. So I don't know, maybe a cute little table will be cute here, but I already have my desk and I just thought that was just gonna be too much. It was gonna be, I don't know, too cluttered. So I don't know, you guys let me know. How will a coat hanger type of deal hook, whatever it's called, um, how would it look here? Just a nice black one so I can hang up all my coats. Other than that, everything is of course coming along my tv side is perfectly fine i am so in love with it cold water you guys is life when i crave cold water when i've like done cleaning and stuff and i'm just so tired cold water is the answer look at all this dust do you guys see that i am going to start editing two days of vlog and i look a mess because of course i have been cleaning i ended up eating a little something i went to a colombian restaurant last night so i had me a bandeja paisa which is my fave um and i had some leftovers so i just ate that for i guess brunch I drank my coffee, finished cleaning. I feel so much better. The only thing that I have to do now is to finish doing my laundry and do my bedroom because my bedroom is a disaster. But I just couldn't get to that today. Um, mainly because, of course, I have Storm in there and she sheds like crazy. You legit can like make another dog as much as she sheds. I feel like it's getting out of hand. I try to mop once a month, like deep clean, but I do vacuum like every single week, sometimes like two or three times a week, to be honest. Because of how much she sheds. So right now I just have to finish editing and I'm kind of so excited because I'm gonna try something new with my videos and I hope you guys can see a difference in quality. I'm just gonna try this trick that, um, I've been wanting to try for the longest time so I'm so excited but really that's it for today's vlog I'm gonna start a new one once I hang up my wall art I'm probably gonna do that tonight if I have time if not I'll just save it for maybe like another day I guess I will just catch you guys in the next vlog I love you and I'll see you next time